Okay, let's talk about how to add a light box or a pop up to your Wix website. So we're going to head over here to add. It's going to be under interactive. And then it's going to be under light boxes. Okay, so they give you just a few to choose from. We go ahead and just choose whichever one you kind of like. Simpler the better. So we're just going to grab this one. Announcement. Okay, so this is a great way to highlight a sale or an opt in or something that you have that you want people to know about. So we're going to just make this the way that it is. But I'm going to give you a few tips and tricks about designing these things. Okay, so you just design it just like you would a page, but you just want to keep it to this particular area right here. Okay, you can also change the box size, but just know that it's going to stretch in both directions because it has to kind of stay centered. You can also move your closed light box sign over here. You just want to make sure that it's visible by changing the design. And then you can add whatever you want to on here, a form, which is what I normally have on here for like a pop-up sign-up thing, for an email opt-in. That's normally how I use it. So then you can click on this on the outside you can change the overlay background. So the setup overlay, clicking on the overlay closes the light box as an option. Change the overlay background to whatever you want. Sometimes I like to oof, not have one this busy. <laughs> and I just like to have like a color pop up. We'll just put this random green color. And then so you can change the background to a specific color. You can also change the settings to different opacities. If you just want it to be like slightly opaque, that's kind of what I prefer so people can see what page they're on. So that's how you do that. And then you can change the background of your light box by clicking the little um, paintbrush button as always. Change the color to let's just say white, all right. And then if you wanted to add a form here, you can add contacts and forms. And then I'm just going for a general subscribe one. We're going to have a whole video and series on the Wix Collective about creating forms and opt-ins. But what we're going to do right now is just click subscribe, just so you can kind of see how this looks. You got to Kind of play the light box game because you only have a little bit of space. So it does take a second to, oops, I'm sorry, completely get this laid out perfectly. Also, I'm pretty sure my computer is like, whoa, lady, restart. <laughs> Way too much going on. So that's how you get that light box to look. This is not beautiful, but you get the picture, right? So well, let's talk about mobile basically the same as everything else on mobile you just have to make it look good on mobile right okay that looks pretty good let's go back to desktop now we're going to talk about lightbox triggers so click here and click set triggers okay rename it to announcement or whatever you want and then you can automatically display it on all pages if you want to which page I like to do the first page of visitor sees if that's what my goal is. If I'm doing like an opt-in or something, that's what I would select. However, other ways that you use a light box would be like, hey, if you want like an FAQ or like a um, terms and conditions that you just want it to pop up, you don't really want it anywhere else on your site, that would be something else too. Like a first page of visitor sees if this is some sort of promotion. And then set your delay to like at least 30 to 40 seconds. You don't want to be like too eager and annoying. Otherwise, I'll just exit out of there right away. You can also add a close button if you want. OK, next is how do we access this, right? So let's go over here to our home page. Let's say that we wanted to add a button that automatically made that light box pop up. So. We're just going to go with it for now. It says shop now, but what about if we linked it to a light box? We linked it to our announcement light box. What does that look like? Preview. Nice. Cool, huh? So you just use it in your site and link to your light box anywhere on your site. I will tell you, you can't link externally to your light box. Like, I can't go 
from, I can't give a URL to the light box outside of the site. It has to be inside of the site in the editor, okay? Lots of different cool ideas on how to use light boxes and pop-ups, but that gives you a pretty good idea of what you need to do to utilize the light box. So if you have any questions, please let me know. I realize that Wix is like a super creative system to build a website on, and that's why I absolutely love it. But that also means you might need some customized help. So if that's something you're looking for, check out thewixcollective.com where I teach you in my monthly membership group how to create a professional and successful Wix website with monthly guidance. And basically just kind of give you a guide along the way. You know, I wish I would have had this nine years ago when I was creating websites, but you know what? That's okay. <laughs> I learned a lot from YouTube and you can too. So stay tuned for some tutorials. And if you want some more customized help, join me at thewixcollective.com.